Masculine folks have read it, what is something stereotypically feminine that you enjoy? And leave my dirty industrial maintenance job at a steel mill, get home late at night, put on a movie, and drink Moscato Rose champagne. I've been told it's not the most manly thing to do. But it's like Sprite, but alcoholic, and a nice way to unwind. So it became a fun tradition for me for a while. Baking and watching trashy reality TV. Throw on some Jersey Shore while I'm making a cheesecake and I'm in my happy place. Fruity drinks. Look, alcohol tastes bad. It is literally a poison that comes from spoiled food. I want to cover some of it up with sugar, and to hell with anyone who tries to tell me I can't. Occasionally, I like a bubble bath. Or a pedicure. Just because I'm trending towards being more masculine, as opposed to more feminine, doesn't mean I cannot do things to de-stress. I do large sculptures as a hobby but on rare occasions, I make cute little English porcelain earrings. Every Sunday, I have a nice long lavender scented bubble bath with Epsom salt. I watch episodes of Star Trek TNG and sip a cocktail. Also, I run a forge on the weekends. I fucking love the smell of flowers, specifically jasmine. It literally makes my day when I walk past it. I take a couple of seconds to inhale the smell every time. Earlier as I was driving home, I had my window down and smelt it in someone's yard. Literally slowed down and took the longer way home just to appreciate it. I love skincare and hair care. I don't think that's a very feminine thing at all, but apparently in my culture it is. I love being able to practice this sort of self-care and grow my hair out and whatnot, but I get told a lot that's it's kinda getting weird for me to do. But I love being able to work on myself and new confidence in my looks. So it's something I do to take care of myself. Fruity drinks. I don't drink alcohol, but damn, some fruity drinks are just so tasty. Virgin pina coladas are some of my favorites. I was once ridiculed by quite a few of my friends because I love candles. Screw you John, Chad, and Cody, my place smells fucking awesome and has just the right amount of light at night. I love sewing my ruined clothes or stuffies the dog chewed up. I get a huge sense of satisfaction in repairing the damage to clothing that life has inflicted, and for the stuffies I like to imagine I'm some kind of combat medic patching these soldiers up before sending them back out into the combat zone. Leaning heavily on the stereotypically feminine qualifier, I really like housework. I like to clean, I like getting the laundry done, I enjoy cooking and making up new recipes. Love me a mimosa and a pedicure, ideally at the same time. But it'll settle for some bubbly without the OJ while I get my toes done if I must. I'd rather take a bath than a shower. I love nothing more than a hot soap also. I turn into a babbling mess around babies and I'm exactly the wrong look of a guy you want pulling faces at your baby. Yeah, I dunno man. I'm just such a masculine kinda do you know? I only talk in all caps and I shout all the time and drink beer and do barbecue and stuff BRO. I fucking love reading books and cooking. Being affectionate to my male friends telling them that I love them and care about them. Men could stand to do this more. I like plants. My house is full of plants that will thrive indoors. There is something about having green indoors that is just the best. Pedicures, take care of your damn feet dudes give me guff about it, and those dudes have fucked up feet. Painting my nails. I tend to mostly paint mine black but occasionally dark blue or burgundy. I've gotten good to a point my female friends let me do theirs. It's just a relaxing activity and I like the aesthetic. I grew up with a dad who would play pretty pretty princess with me and actually wear the jewelry. He would play with my Barbies with me and let me paint his nails. He was also a marine and a truck driver, as masculine a man as you could get. Love that guy so much for it. It's so lovely to scroll through this thread and see other guys comfortable enough to talk about their feminine side, heart. I take a bubble bath and read fanfics every so often. I DGAF. My body hurts and it smells delightful. Manicure. My hands are rough and beat up. I've tried doing a better job of taking care of my hands on my own but it always turns out poorly. They're professionals and do a much better job. Cooking and gardening. Nothing beats the satisfaction of watching your plants grow happy and then harvesting it to eat. Then making a nice dish out of things you grew. Sewing my kids Halloween and costumes. Something my mom always did for me and it makes the holiday way more special for all of us. Skin and nail care routines. There's nothing feminine or gay about being clean and hygienic, but if there's then too damn bad, I'm still doing it. I watched Married at First Sight with my fiancé, at first it was just a joke to me, but now I'm the first on the couch every Wednesday night. Baking, specifically breads and cupcakes. 
in my defense my mother owned a bakery for years, so I am taking advantage of her wealth of knowledge while she is still with me. I've made more homemade pizza crust pizzas in the past three months than I care to admit in my quest for what I personally consider perfect. I cry at movies all the time. Even if it's just some action schlock if there is one scene where the grizzled divorced cop reconnects with his distanced hacker thief kid I'm wiping away tears. It's just more fun to let yourself be emotionally invested. My 54F partner 62 meters has discovered pedicures. Loves them. Gets his toenails painted whatever color he's feeling that day. I fucking love it. It's sexy and it makes a statement. Get on board gentlemen. Masculine folks? Does that include girls too? Because I know some girls being more masculine than your average alpha male. I'd say I fit the manly moniker pretty well. 6'3 plus 240 pounds, former infantry marine, now I work in construction. I enjoy shooting, lifting weights, and drinking. I also enjoy making and drinking poo air tea, getting pedicures with my wife, and I look pretty damn good in a pink button down. I enjoy cooking and baking, though I'm not that good at it yet. I can do some pasta dishes and grill stuff. I've also gotten into flower gardening but that's mostly for pollinators for my vegetables. I also do probably 85 of the dishes in the laundry because I work from home I can pretty easily start a load and run it during the day and fold or put it away after I clock out. The fruitiest of fruity drinks, vacuuming, holding my wife's hand, and nice smells. Used to do candles, but wife says no on artificial scented stuff. I like cutting my cuticles and filing my nails. I had a lady friend tell me it was gay for some reason. I let my daughters paint my toenails. I enjoy that it makes them happy. Does that count? But I started enjoying sangria, baking. Never thought I would be into it until I became the first member of my family to be able to perfectly replicate my great grandmother's cookie recipe. Now take a lot of pride in it. Bad Girls Club is my secret vice. Ever since an ex showed me it's been my dirty little secret and all the women I've been with love how much I get into it lol. I give myself mud masks weekly. I love to garden and I love creating gardens for friends and family. I can pick a bouquet of flowers like no other. I've discovered a hundred ways to make a cheesecake and my Christmas cookies are to die for. I have four cats and I look forward to cuddling them every single day. I think the most masculine thing a man can do is be comfortable with his feminine side. Flowers, and wearing long flowy clothes like a kimono. Nice to get some proper airflow between the legs lol. The feel of silk on my skin. My wife bought me an old fashioned night shirt made of silk that goes to just above my knees and omg it's so comfortable, both cool and warm at the same time. The shaving cream that smells like berries. It's just shaving cream, but marketed for gals. I love it. Pretty drinks. I don't care if it's pink with an orchid in it, a grapefruit basil martini is fucking good. I anything that's feminine. I'm always so masculine but being so masculine gets boring, I enjoy stuff like dresses, makeup, you know. Man, I like me some pedicures. I get one on my birthday every year. I also like drinks with the little umbrellas in them. I like Taylor Swift a lot. I work on a ranch and I unapologetically play her music while working on tractors. I look like a lumberjack and I love pina colada. It's funny when my wife orders a beer and she gets handed pina colada and I get the beer. Ballet is fun I love leaping across the floor and balancing on one leg on my tiptoes and doing all the ballet things. Shopping for clothes and coordinating my outfits. Bubble baths with the whole works, bath bombs and everything. Cocktails. Love them, I don't give a shit if it's pink. Got a sparkler in it or a mini umbrella. If it tastes good and gets me fucked, it's going inside me. Baths. Showers are great but a nice luxurious bath with some Epsom salts or a bath bomb at the end of a shifty day is amazing. 90 of the time I'm a gin tonic man, but every so often I go full JD and want something sweet, colorful and festooned with unnecessary drink accessories. I like pastel colors. Oh and I'm a sucker for a good romance. Cried like a baby after watching A Walk to Remember 2002. I love the show Project Runway. Mostly because I like building things and watching these men and women create fashion out of nothing is very interesting. My fiancé is the person who got me hooked, and she got her dad watching it too, and he's the type of guy who drinks beer regularly while working on his cars and killing rattlesnakes at his house in the desert. My hair is quite long, and I love having it braided. I can't do it myself yet. But most of my friends are women and like to braid it. Sometimes they'll give me a small one on the side other times they'll tie all of it up into a French braid or fishtail. Whatever they do, I love the way a good braid looks and feels. Fruity alcoholic drinks. Beer tastes awful. 
all of it, but I enjoy hard cider and fruity mixed drinks, baking, fruity cocktails and often you'll find me listening to Taylor Swift. Her music is my guilty pleasure and I crank it in the car on my commute most days. I love cooking, baking and cleaning. I also turn into the softest man in the world around dogs, especially my own. I like love songs and sing them enthusiastically in the car. Before and after I listen to death metal and gangsta rap. I'm sorry, but this thread is crazy. I wonder if it's mostly western comments or something? American? Eating a salad is feminine? Reading books? Taking care of your kids? What? Cindy candles, in proper scents like vanilla and lavender, not trendy man smell candles like Wajet or Bear Burbs hyperbolizing, but just a tad. Wearing pink. X200B. My wife gives me shit about it sometimes, but I truly love the color pink. Especially if it's a pastel shade. X200B. That said, pink used to be a man's color, I heard it years ago or so. Some years ago I was with a group that said it wasn't cool to enjoy Cindy candles, like, the fuck. I can't like things that smell nice? Fuck off with that bullshit. I can't have mint soap or rose candles? We're dudes. Cooking and baking, which confuses me because how the fuck is this feminine? Learn some basic life skills, get dumbasses. Well many have commented this but those sweet girly cocktails. I love them even though they make me look gay.